Hey guys, Brad coming at you here with a little mail day. Got something from the eBay authentication program. So I found a nice rare merino that popped up and I was lucky enough to win it. So we'll see. Hopefully that's what's in here. That's why like anytime it's expensive stuff, I like to open it on camera just in case. So... <clears throat> This guy actually had two things I needed, but, you know, they were both high-end, so I just had to pick one and roll with it, you know. Like, which one was I going to be aggressive on? That's what we did here. Let's see. It's, it's not open. Yes, it looks like the right item. So, if you've never used eBay authentication, they put it in this thing and void of damage, blah, blah, blah. They put it in this nice little blue box. I think I've had one on the channel before, so you guys by now have seen it. But it was hilarious. They send this to me. And in the message, basically, we authenticated nothing, but uh, it's on your way. We could not authenticate this patch or that it's real or anything like that, but uh, it seems like the holder was not messed with. <laughs> oh, it's such a joke. It's hilarious. Okay. But to the item, that's the important thing. It just happens to be graded, but that isn't why I bought it. Uh, 2009 Exquisite Collection Football, which was probably the second best year of Exquisite. I'd put 2008 first, and then 2009. I think those were the two best years of Exquisite. Um, it's rare materials. Gold, numbered three out of ten. And this is nasty. This is stuff you don't see of Marino very often. Look at that. Tags. He tags. Look at that guy. So you've got two tags, two uh, Wilson tags. Right there. Uh, the NFL, for those who don't know, from 89 to 94, I believe, used Wilson as its main jersey person. And then it was Nike for a few years, and then Reebok had it for, like, 15 years or something. And then Nike obviously has done it the last few. But, uh, yeah, 89 to 94, they had Wilson. So that's why you see the Wilson tags, and then you've got the patch. And like I said, you just don't see stuff like that very often. And I pretty much know it's real because I remember seeing a pack pulled one that actually had four tags, which recently had come up for sale, and I lost it a couple months ago. So these are legit. Somebody didn't mess with these, you know. Um, but, yeah, three out of ten. The glare is really working it. Let's see, maybe do it down here. Claire is working overtime today. There we go. But it's graded a PSA 8, by the way. But like I said, a card like this, I don't even know why you bother grading it. Because it isn't like they're telling you it's an authentic card, because they have no idea. You, know, <laughs> you have to do that research on your own. But uh, gold, 3 out of 10. Great set. All the quads in this set look nice. I think most of them, I think it varies, but usually it's 35 or less is the base for these. But, uh, yeah, for an exquisite card, it is an 8 for an exquisite card, by the way, is like getting a 10 on a Chrome card, you know. <laughs> um, yeah, just very minor edge stuff. So it looks properly graded. I would say that would be an 8. And like I said, that's really good for these cards. So Dan Marino. 3 of 10, 09 Exquisite, PSA 8, which like I said, that doesn't really matter. 
But uh, gorgeous car. Sorry, the glare is really working. But uh, you get to see the main part. So that was awesome. This is why you haven't been uh, seeing any mail days here the last few weeks, right? I bought the Chris Carter, and this is the only thing since because this wasn't cheap, you know. But uh, worth it because I don't have any Wilson tags in my collection. So that was a must-have. Um, so, yeah, that's all I got, just one card. But it was a doozy. So NFL season starts tonight uh, with Lions Chiefs. Uh, Travis Kelsey had a scare. Seems like that's very minor. Could even play today which he's one of those, if it's just a pain threshold thing, he'll be out there. If it's structural, then that's different, but they seem to think it's not structural. So, If I was a betting man, from the way I'm hearing, it wouldn't surprise me if he tries to give it a go. I don't know. But it uh, should be a good game, honestly. I think it'll be a fun one to watch. Um, but, yeah, and then Sunday, Dolphins Chargers. Should be just a really good game, I think. Chargers out-schemed us last time, outplayed us last year. So we will see if we can counterpunch that. It was one of the few games all year where I felt like we got out-coached, out-schemed. So we'll see if that happens again. But uh, thanks for watching. Real excited to add this bad boy. And, uh, yeah, talk to you later.